Video number three, exposure setting. Exposure refers to the amount of light hitting the image sensor when you capture a video. There are three ways to adjust light levels. One, the iris opens or closes to allow more light or limit the light. It is expressed in f-stops. F-stops are fractions. One over 5.6 is a larger opening than one over 16. It is usually expressed simply as 5.6 or 16. So we have to remember that 5.6 will allow more light in than 16. Openings larger than 5.6 can create a shallow depth of field, so the background is blurred. Everything remains in focus with a small aperture like 16. This is useful for a scene when you need everything in focus. Shutter speed is usually set at twice the frame rate. If you shoot at 24 frames per second, set your shutter speed at 48 or 50 frames per second. Slowing the shutter speed will allow more light in, but could result in a blurred motion. Speeding up the shutter attenuates the light, but can result in a stilted image. Gain is the electronic amplification of the video signal. Too much gain will cause the image to appear grainy. This is called video noise. There are two ways to adjust the iris on the NX70U. One, elect the menu, select camera audio. Choose iris by touching the right side of this menu item. Select manual and adjust the aperture with the plus or minus scale. The second way, on the left side of the camera, switch the lens dial to iris and press the button marked iris. Dial the manual ring to change the f-stop. To adjust the shutter speed or gain, enter the menu. Choose gain or shutter speed and again go to the manual scale and use the plus or minus to adjust. When in doubt it is better to be underexposed. Overexposed images or blown out images cannot be rescued in post. While in the manual mode, you can also adjust the iris by pressing the iris push auto button located on the top right portion of the camera. Histogram is a graphic representation of the grayscale in your image. Pure black is on the left and pure white is on the right. The vertical axis shows the intensity for each grayscale value. Shadows mid-tones and highlights are represented left to right. To turn it on, go to the menu, camera audio, scroll down the menu, and select histogram.